Okay, here we're working on a Cub Cadet Zero Turn. I've done other videos on this already. We're going to replace a broken bell crank. That's what the part's called. It's for the steering. It converts the forward and backward motion of your handles to an up and down motion for the hydro motors. And this shaft I'm taking off, this holds the bell cranks, the left and the right bell crank. And they got corroded onto the shaft, and one of them broke the ear off that the linkage is hooked up to. So I ordered a new one, and uh, we're going to take this apart, put the new one on, and lube everything up so that they last a while and make this steer better. Oh, yes. There is a nut on the back of that. So I'm going to have to put this on the tripod and... Get back to this. I'm waiting for somebody to show up. All right, so we're going to get this shaft out of there. There we go. Well, this is, we're going to make sure we lube this up. This is going to make it work easier once we lubricate inside here. This should rotate around so I can get to the cotter bins easier. doesn't want to turn very much so we're gonna to have to spray that side just to get it to slide through there no wonder this broke this is some place that these should have grease fittings in them Take another cotter pin out. There we go. Now we can slide this over farther. A little more yet. Alright, so we want to get the new one to make sure we put it on the right way. Go on just like that. If I get this off of here, wow. Time for more tools. Now, let's see if we can talk this into giving up. This is unbelievable how tight this is. All right, I asked nicely. It wants to be difficult.
I win. Now to get all the aluminum shavings off my hands. Way too tight. So now we know why why that tab broke off. They had these on. Should have been some kind of bushing in here. Or a grease fitting. Because maybe it would have got greased once. We'll put some grease on here. much better.
Okay, so here you can see it didn't want to move. I have to go back and push the release levers back in. I had those out so I could move it around a little bit. But uh, it works a lot better now like this. Those uh, bell cranks, that's what they're called, that part I replaced. They, they were getting corroded. They were sticking on the shaft. And one of the tabs actually broke off on the right side. I could tell from the beginning something wasn't right. The right side handle was hard to push all the way forward. And now they work a lot better, so it's ready to go. If you find these kind of videos helpful, please like and subscribe so I do more.